My name is Linda Gage, and I was one of the co-founders of Life Cycles. I've been a volunteer, I've been a staff person, and I'm a board member 20 years later. Life Cycles is a really exciting organization and, and has been in its history because it provides a lot of ways for people to get involved and be able to uh, grow food, pick food, share food, eat food, celebrate food. And the one thing that is, is stayed true to Life Cycles is that it's always taken a very positive and celebratory look at food. The reason why I think Life Cycles is so important is because it provides the opportunity for people to get their hands in the dirt, to plant a seed and see a plant grow. And there's nothing more powerful, more profound than that. Being able to have a piece of fruit and eat it and taste what you've created and that it's such a simple thing, but yet it's so powerful. And that's why Life Cycles has resonated for all these years. Life Cycles grew out of a really interesting time. It was just after the Earth Summit, and many people were starting to talk about sustainability. But food wasn't part of that conversation at that time. And one of the things that I remember about the very first seeds of Life Cycles was 12 midnight in a hotel room in Quito, and a group of youth were sitting around talking about how youth in Latin America, in Chile, Santiago de Chile, we're building community, and we began to talk about the power of community gardens to do that. And that's when I knew there was something special here, when the, the youth in the room were so excited and we continued to talk well until the morning hours. Our first project was to do a community garden. We thought of it as a project, a change project, and we didn't realize we were creating an organization that was gonna go 20 years. And here we are 20 years later, a little older, a little wiser, but we still believe in change-oriented projects that you can touch and see and feel. So it really makes me feel about this, all this work that we're doing and all that we hear about the local food movement. It actually is happening and you can see it right there before your eyes. Organizations like Life Cycles allow the community to come together and put solutions forward and do all of the things that are going to make that difference on an individual and community basis. We need you to support organizations like Life Cycles who are on the front lines of this work, doing all the things that are simple and powerful and are making a difference. So if you can come and volunteer, get engaged, donate money, we need Life Cycles to exist for another 20 years.